Right then it is time to give my views about the World Cup. Sadly the hardware shop is closed Dells I would have bought some paint, used it and watched it dry solely to find something more interesting to do. Well I've locked the door, so you cannot leave, until I have finished. I will start with Group A. Bloody hell you mean I've got to listen to your opinions on all eight groups? Tough today. I rate the French as favourites to win Group A, but I do not fancy a bet on them. I will play along. The French are 6-4 to four to win a weak looking group. Surely that is value. The French manager is barking mad and the French team struggled to qualify. I think the Mexicans are the best value at just over 3-1. to one. Uruguay also struggled to qualify, and South Africa may be outclassed. South Africa are on an excellent run. Home advantage should count for them. They lost in qualifying for the African Nations Cup away to Sierra Leone. The Czech Republic lost away to Luxembourg in qualifying for Euro 1996. They then came second in the championship itself. It was the only qualifying game they lost, and they qualified ahead of the Dutch. I do not think the South Africa result was a one-off. Anyway I think whoever comes first or second will lose in the last 16. Now on to Group B. So who do you think will qualify with Argentina? It looks pretty close. More to the point will Argentina qualify. Are you nuts? Have you seen the players they have? What is the problem? Sniff. 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 Why are you sniffing and rubbing your nose? It is just a point. Would you trust a manager who has snorted half of Colombia? I will admit Maradona was a risky choice as manager. Risky is not the word. You might as well have chosen Gaza. I think Nigeria and South Korea are good bets to win Group B. The 25 to 1 available on Argentina to finish bottom is a good bet. Furthermore, I think both will make the quarterfinals with Nigeria beating Mexico and South Korea shocking France. I suppose you're going to say England will be beaten in Group C and that Algeria will win it. I agree that Algeria are too high a price. However, for once I actually fancy England for the World Cup. The loss of Ferdinand is a blow, but I'm still hopeful. Sod. I know your track record. We will not get past the second round due to your kiss of death. 1994 you tipped Nigeria and they went out in the second round. They won their group ahead of Argentina and Bulgaria, but were unlucky to play Italy in the second round. Argentina were your tip in 1998 and they lost in the quarters. Only due to a Bergkamp wonder goal. 2002 you said Portugal and Cameroon were the value and that Germany would go out in the group stage. Portugal lost to the USA and South Korea and the Germans reached the final with Cameroon going out in the group stage. I apologize for my oversight in not realizing the Germans would play Paraguay, the USA and South Korea to reach the final. Yes and in 2006 you said the Dutch would win and that Argentina would go out in the group stage. Are you still bitter about 1998 that you keep hating Argentina? The Dutch lost to the Portuguese in a bizarre game with four players sent off. Anyway, I'm confident England will win the group, but the price is a little short. Not much else here, so I will move on to Group D. The Germans are nearly even money is that a decent price to win the group? Yes it is. We always say the Germans do not have a good side, but the cliché holds. You can never write them off. They are certainly the best team in the group. Balax? I know I have locked you in but there is no need for language like that. I will not stand for it. Balax injury is a problem for the Germans. I will let you off. But just watch it. Bast. Right that is it. You and me outside now. I will have to unlock the door, but I will beat you up, bring you back in, lock the door again, and I will tell you that Serbia will come second, but England and Germany will win their last 16 matches. Bastian Schweinsteiger will need to come to the rescue. It is a good job for you. I'm not standing nearer to you. Closer. You want me closer? You will get a bunch of fives soon. Closer could be a good bet for top goal scorer. He has an excellent record in the World Cup. You are doing this on purpose just to wind me up. I will move on to Group E. We'll see will not take long. Hurrah. The Dutch are easily the best side. 
It is tied for second, but I will give the edge to the Danes over Cameroon. Group F to do now. The Italians are usually slow starters. Is it worth taking them on here? I think Slovakia are a good price to win the group. I think the Italians will qualify and are the most likely side to win the group. However, their record in winning groups is shaky, and at the prices I prefer Slovakia. I'm not sure how to read the South American form, because the qualifying all seemed much of a muchness. Therefore I'm a bit wary of Paraguay. New Zealand will not qualify. The Dutch and the Italians should make the quarters from this section of the draw. Group G already. My suicidal thoughts have decreased. Brazil are the only winners here. Ivory Coast and Portugal are not good enough. North Korea might qualify as they beat some fair sides to get here. The odds of 27 to 1 to qualify are worth a bet. Portugal will probably come second, but they are not the team they used to be. Ronaldo needs more consistency at an international level. The Spanish look good in Group H I think that the attacking Chile team will join them. Brazil and Spain will make the quarterfinals. Spain versus Portugal would be an fantastic last 16 match. Shut up. It would be interesting though. Quarterfinals now. Who do you think will win? I only ask to get the torture over as soon as possible. I have England playing South Korea which we will win. Even if France qualified I think we would beat them. The concern in our quarter is whether Argentina get it together to end up playing us. I still think we would win. I think the second semi could see a surprise with the Dutch beating Brazil. I was a great fan of Dunga when he was a player. Not the most fashionable, but without him, you would not have had Romero and Bobito. He has made Brazil a solid unit as their manager, but I fear they may not be good enough. The shock in the quarters I think will be Nigeria as I believe they can beat the Germans. Are you sure? Remember the Germans reached the final of Euro 2008. The Germans reached the finals of 1992 Euros in 1996 and won the latter. However, they lost in the next World Cup quarters finals to Bulgaria and to Croatia. In the last quarter final I think Spain will be too strong for Italy. However, betting on Italy to lose on penalties in any time in the World Cup is a good bet. It is how they lost in 1990, 1994 and 1998. They also only lost to a golden goal in 2002 and one in 2006. They have not lost in normal time since 1986. Right then we now have the semi-finals. It will be very difficult to call England versus the Netherlands. I will go for us to win. I think Spain beating Nigeria is clearer cut. I also think the Dutch will win the third place playoff. Go on. Before I get Stockholm Syndrome who will win the final. For once despite the injury to Ferdinand I'm tipping England.